Hello everyone! Only a few months left to welcome the new season of Yellowstone. The modern western show is one of the gems of the last decade's TV revolution. Even though we got very lucky in the TV realm and have multiple masterpieces in the past few years, still, some of the shows managed to stand out. This is a very remarkable success, especially considering the fact that the competition for the greater ratings is higher than ever, and people tend to consume fast and move on to the next big thing at all times. Therefore, seeing Yellowstone flourishing in the TV industry from one season after another is simply astonishing. It's familiar, and yet still unique somehow, combining classical Western features with modern plots. Since the ending of the season 3 of the show was a total shock to all of us, the hype over season 4 is more than ever. In the season 3 finale, we watched three of our main cast, John, Beth, and Casey, facing death due to subsequent attacks. John and Casey got shot while Beth was ambushed in her office as a mystery delivery box got exploded. All three scenes were unexpected, brutal, and too real. Since Yellowstone is following the footsteps of shows like Game of Thrones when it comes to the shocking value, it's never safe to assume that the main cast numbers are untouchable. On the contrary, they have been through some unbelievable things, and we wouldn't be surprised if one of them would get killed. That being said, such development of the events would break our hearts, since we love all three of them. Thankfully, we got to see a small teaser about the new season, showing us some glimpses of the upcoming plot. We see John crawling on the road in blood, revisit the scenes of the attacks and the faces of almost all the characters of the show, all of whom look terrified and concerned. We also see Rip, quite angry and seem to be ready to launch a revenge campaign against whoever dared to attack his lover, Beth. Yes, we believe we will watch a season of revenge, and Rip will probably be the one who is leading it. Considering it's been only a short while since he and Beth finally got together for real after years of back and forth, it seems pretty rightful for him to seek to hold responsible parties accountable for interrupting his happiness. We believe all of the attacks were linked with each other in one way or another. This means that whoever plotted it had some serious issues with the Duttons and was ready to face them. The first name that comes to mind is, of course, Garrett Randall, the biological father of Jamie. At this point, one question comes to mind. Does Jamie know about these? Is he involved in the attacks? No matter how horrible his relationship with his family, it's hard to believe that he would be okay to kill all three of them in cold blood. Still, this is Yellowstone, and we can never be sure of who does something and why. Will anyone really be killed, though? Well, that's the question that we all seek an answer to. Fortunately, we have some clues. The character list of the new season refers to John as one of the key plot points in another character's story. We believe this wasn't a coincidence, and he will survive the attack. Nevertheless, it's worth mentioning that Kevin Costner, who plays the part of John, stated previously about the fate of his character that there's an ending that you're going to see. Hopefully, it's a powerful one for you. Just try to enjoy it right up to the end if you can. Yes, it sounds suspicious. We believe Beth will also survive since she has the most exciting love plot in the show and many watch the series just for her and Rip's story. When it comes to Casey, though, we cannot talk in the same certainty. Still, we hope to see him in Season 4 as well, that's for sure. What do you think of Yellowstone? Who do you think will survive in Season 4? Let us know in the comments below. Thank you for watching and see you later.